I'm good. being forcibly removed from the building again of a public lobby, so. So if you want to take off that gun and badge, I'm happy to scrap with you one day. You want to do it, You let's do it. Let me know, buddy. That is not a crime. And you're telling me to get out of my vehicle. Do you know where Lieutenant Mingus is right now? So no, he's not in the building? What do you know? I'm not telling you nothing else until I find out who's driving that vehicle. You not a supervisor, bro. I need somebody higher than you right now. I didn't break the law. I'm not going to be found guilty of anything. This is a waste of time. If you guys want to know who I am, I'll tell you who I am. Okay. You want to know what I'm doing here? I'll tell you what I'm doing here. Uh, if you didn't know, I went to the police academy and they kicked me out. That's my purse! I don't know you! Spit me on my face right now! She spit in my face! Today's video takes us to Fourth Sykes, Georgia, where we find a pair of idiots, J. Tom Press and Russell from Georgia Transparency, as they attempt once again to film voters at the precinct. Why do frauditors do such a stupid thing? I don't know. But they're going to demand their rights. Rights to what? I don't know. But stay tuned. Sit back, watch, and... <laughs> Enjoy! Georgia Transparency is going hot. Still in Monroe County, still with J-Town Press. We are going into the County Administration Building uh, in the Tax Assessor's Office. So without further ado, hey, let's, uh, let's hop into it. A few moments later. Here we are with Independent Press. Yes, Do y'all have permission from upstairs to be doing all this? Oh, we've got permission from the owners of the building. Okay. They gave us a thumbs up, said it was okay. Okay. Yeah. How you doing? Good, good. How you doing? You having a good day, ma'am? I am. What is your name, ma'am? I'm Karen. Karen, okay, your position here. I'm the admin, admin, uh, admin, administrative assistant for the community development oh. department. This is the idiot behind the camera. His name's Russell, and he was recently fired from his job as a private investigator because he was too stupid to know the law, and then, oh dearie me, lost his job. Now, for some reason, he's teamed up with the J-Town Press, Lana. This is Lana. Hey, I'm not sure about Lana. I think Lana is a guy trying to live his life as a woman. I don't care about all that. I'm just making an observation. But let's go ahead and continue. That's a mouthful, that one. That's a mouthful. <laughs> <laughs> Is this the water department? It is. Can I help you? Oh, yeah. Let's take a little look around. Thank you. Mask is required. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That's must be an old sign. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Thanks, Don John. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey. Oh, hey. Hey, hey. Oh. Man, you sneaky, sneaky. Man, <laughs> holy. Oh, man. You have your ninja shoes on. Man, I turn around for a second. I didn't know why I turn around and you right here. Like, oh, you scared me. Yeah, I heard something about that. I was right here. <laughs> and I heard something going, man, I'm like, no, we were checking out all the stuff in here. How you doing? Oh, they called the police? Hey. How's it going? What's your name, sir? Wilson. Deputy Wilson. Uh, nice yeah. to meet you. What y'all doing? Just a little filming. Just so everyone knows, these two are a pair of cop haters. Matter of fact, they don't like authority of any kind. They want to be free. They want to be free. They want to be free. Well, as far as I know, you live in America and you are free. You just can't do anything you want, though. There's limitations to all that. It's the obvious, though. So. All right, y'all got some ID? Some ID for what? Yeah. I need to see some ID. What did I do? We well, hadn't done anything yet, but I just want to see why y'all in the building filming and filming. Oh. oh, is this a private building? No, it's not a private building. It's a government building. But it's, is it open to the public? Well, it's open to the public. Okay, have a good day, Deputy. Oh, okay. Have a good day, sir. This is awesome. Y'all can't be going back in the office. Sir? Going back in the office. Publicly accessible area, sir. All right. I'll call you. 
But aren't you the sheriff? No, he's not the sheriff. He's a deputy. Yeah, but he, he's a representative of the sheriff. Yeah. I'm just building security. He's building security here. Oh, okay. Have we broke a law? Oh, you probably... Well, you're being evasive. Yes, you Folks are, are voting. So, in public? What law is it? Folks are voting, too. But in public? But we didn't... You can't be filming in a building where they're voting. Now, we just had a little punk on here yesterday that wanted to do the same thing. I might be able to excuse him because he's only about 18, 19 years old. But you're a grown man, Russell. An overgrown man at that. You should know better. Is that how you lost your job and now you have to fraud it for a living? Oh, that's just terrible, Russell. What would your mama say? We're not filming people voting. Well, we We're in a public that. area. We don't know that. I just, who, who are you, sir? I'm code enforcement with Jim. What's your name? You don't need to know my name. Make it a good picture of your face, not yeah. forward request it. No. Yeah, you forward request it. Oh, yeah. Public well, reference request, sir. Whatever, I don't care what you do, but well, you, po you post you my picture out somewhere here. Well, it'll be out there. I get uh, several million people watch it, so. Yeah, you better hope it don't. You are definitely going to be, especially with that attitude. You are not supposed to be down here filming. I didn't film that. Oh, excuse me, sir. I'm just trying to get by. Y'all? How do I know that? Y'all up here for some other reason, I guarantee you. Uh, Deputy, well, I'm sorry, I didn't, what was his name? Uh, Wilson. Wilson, to have, is it, have I committed a crime, sir? We'll go find out in just a second. Okay. I'm sure. Until then, have a good day, sir. You're not going to need a product. Have a good day, Deputy. <laughs> Russell learned the frauditing game mighty quickly since he's become unemployed, hasn't he? He never used to be this condescending or smug. Yeah, he just doesn't care anymore. And now that he teamed up with J-Town Press, I guess she's showing him the ropes on how to be a punk. Yeah. Russell, I tell you what, man. Is your PI license revoked in the state of Georgia? Maybe move to Florida and apply for a PI license because frauding is not for you. I called upstairs to my supervisor uh -huh. to find out why y'all were here. Oh, if they were okay. Aware. Oh, okay. Yes, because we don't. You didn't introduce yourself or so let us know who you are. Oh, okay. Um, my name's Russ. Mm -hmm. And what was your name, ma'am? It doesn't matter. I work in the water department. See that? Uh-uh. He's getting all grabby with my stuff. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. We don't need to touch people, sir. Uh -huh. That's well, you don't need That's you don't need getting my fly zone neither, sir. What zone, sir? My fly. This is my zone here. You need to move on. I'm not going nowhere. You will go somewhere. Okay. And while they're voting, you shouldn't even be around here. Where's the signs at? It doesn't matter where the signs is. Those are private boxes for folks to vote. Okay, then they can vote all they want to. Well, who are you with? I'm by myself, sir. Well, you better buy yourself somewhere else and quit going in these offices. Uh look at you, Russell. What are you going to do for the rest of your life? Just look at you. Have you looked in the mirror lately, boy? You need to do something about your appearance. You need to get yourself together and find a real job. You're going to fraud it the rest of your life? What are you going to do when YouTube demonetizes this platform? What will you do? Live with your mama? Do you get paid by the taxpayer, sir? I get paid by the taxpayers, and it's none of your business. So we pay your salary, sir. Why aren't we? Anywhere in the public part of the building. They're not allowed in any office. Well, they're not allowed to be shooting anything down there. Did you see me point? Did you see me? Okay. Did you see me point down there? Have you seen me point down there? No, I haven't. Okay. So what law have we violated? You haven't violated anything unless actually, you're going into a private office. So, you're so, not allowed to go into a private Can I ask you a quick question? So if I came up and touched you, what would happen right now? Just hypothetical. I'm not going to be baited into your uh, stuff. I'm not. I'm just, my, my, my question is... I moved just, her camera he, out of my he, he touched my So thumb, what about so. pressing charges on him since he... Yeah, you he, he literally just admitted since, since, since he put his hands... You're starting to become a disturbance. I'm not. Okay. I didn't say nothing to yes, anybody. Yes, you're disturbing. You know. Sir, you cannot Everyone turn... Sir, you cannot turn a First Amendment protected activity into a crime. I'm not trying to do that. But you you're are, saying... But you're being evasive. You're not giving up any idea. Because I we don't have to. what? I know you're not here to... Did you swear... Blow up the building. Did you... I do apologize, Sheriff, but you're dealing with two idiots. As a matter of fact, they're less than idiots, because if you added both of them together, you still wouldn't have a complete idiot. So there you have it. Did you swear I, I know you're not trying to do anything like that. Did you swear I the Constitution? 
Did you swear an oath to the Constitution? That's not a beta question, it's a yes or no. You are not allowed in any private offices. Did we go into Y'all have a good day. Oh. They're not allowed in any private offices then. Well, it needs to be marked off as private. <clears throat> hmm. You got issues, don't you? Yeah, the boy does. Here, I love you. Just don't come in this is a public office, sir. She said it was this public. Is public. This is not open to the public? Is this not open to the public? Is this not open to the public? This is public office. Is it's saying? Okay. Okay. Well, okay. Then you did, the onus is on you, right? That's what you do right there. See how it closes, she closes the door? That's what you do. There you go. You want to say goodbye to everybody? Is that your supervisor? Uh, no, I have nothing. I have nothing else to say. Uh, I'm actually okay. a supervisor here. What's your oh, name, okay. Hmm? There you go, ma'am. That's the best way to handle frauditors. Just don't engage with the idiots. Don't talk to them. Yeah, because they're all a pack of morons with a cell phone camera. They think they're journalists, members of the press. You see your backpack? It says press on it. Yeah, press here. Right. What's your name? What's your name? Well, you're the one that walks to the public. You approach me and ask me questions. Can no, I, I didn't. Can, can, can I step out? That's no problem. Can I'll I find step out? Is. I just, you just asked who the supervisor was that I said I was. Okay, then what's your name, ma'am? So you've approached me with questions. No, you just came into the office right here. That's my office. Uh, okay. Sir, you can handle business. We don't, we don't really understand what's going on right now. <laughs> Well, didn't Deputy Wilson just inform y'all that we're allowed to film inside the public areas of this building? Is that something you don't like, ma'am? Are you a supervisor? You're a supervisor? What is your name and this is how you treat the public? I just think you're being a little silly. The public that comes in here and handles business, we love. Well, then what's your name? With. Then what's... We don't understand what you're doing. How is it you? because of this right here? It's because of this. Mm -hmm. It's because of the camera, maybe? Mm -hmm. I don't know. And, uh, ma'am, what was your name again? I'm so sorry. I'm a water clerk here at the water department. I don't appreciate you calling the upstairs and getting a man you know, with a badge and a gun to do our job down here. here. Did you hear what old Rusty Boy said? I don't appreciate you calling upstairs. But Rusty Boy, she doesn't appreciate you walking around filming her all day with your little cell phone camera either. Rusty boy, go get a job. This is not for you. You're a little bit too polite. You got to be a little more nasty to be a frauditor. Yeah, be a little bit more like, say, uh, oh no, I better not mention any names. But you just have to be nasty. And y'all are uh, interfering with our work. So I don't appreciate that the police called on me for we no crime. We have crimes. every right for our protection. We don't know who y'all are. You didn't introduce yourselves. And you're coming in and you're filming us? We're allowed to film in here, ma'am. Um, they're no, no. harassing us in we the don't office know. now. <sighs> I just asked you your name, okay, ma'am. Thank you. Bye. I just asked you your name, ma'am. Now you're going to lie. We probably need to go live. Mm -hmm. Now you're going to lie. <sighs> Who's nuts, ma'am? They're, they're sitting here calling the police because they said that we're causing a disturbance by asking them their name. So. It's the Monroe County Monroe County Administration Office here in Forsyth, Georgia. Howdy, Gravy. How's it going, Eric? We have literally, they, uh, now they're locking us out of the, uh, now they're locking us out of the, uh, the office, even though it it's Lana talking. I guess there's not enough to do in Florida, so she decided to drive over the state line and hang out in Georgia with the unemployed frauditor. Maybe she's showing him the ropes. Is she showing you the ropes, Russell, on how to become a real ignorant frauditor? She's got a pretty smart mouth, too, I tell you. Yeah, all frauditors have a smart mouth, but she has an exceptionally smart mouth. Says open. As long as y'all stay out there in that area, y'all can stay. Why does everything come in off? If it's a public office, man. <laughs> yeah, you can't come in off. It's, it's a public office, though, here, isn't it? No, don't cross my feet. This is a, this is a public office. Uh, 
everybody. It's Paula. Oh, excuse me, ma'am. That's the uh, lady right there that won't identify. So <laughs> she's a supervisor. You're she's harassing everybody, and you're so funny. You think it's all us that is the problem? Ma'am, you approached us. No, I really didn't. Y'all called. You were in my office. Y'all, ma'am, that's the people's office. I know it. And you see those two taxpayers there? We are helping them. We're a taxpayer as well. Uh, we don't know what you're doing. <laughs> we don't know what you're doing. <laughs> you're you're a little concerned. Is is it because my camera? I don't care about your camera. So if I walked in here without a camera looking to see what this building provides, then it'd be okay? I don't understand something, Russell. Why do you walk in someplace where you have absolutely no business being? You know, it's something different altogether. If you have business there, but you have no business. And filming is not a business. You're a moron. You're a moron, and you'll always be a moron. Yeah. Go back to uh, private investigating, if you can get a job, that is. You'd be a normal citizen. Yeah. So I'd be a, You're harassing people. Let me get this straight. You're normal. harassing people. When did I harass anybody? You harassed yeah, all you of us. Can you articulate how I harassed Yes, you harassed us by walking in there and filming us. Nobody does that. Then you, that. You, said, I said, you said, what's your name? I said, what's your name? And you I said, I identify. asked you a question. But you can have, have, have to identify. You're a public servant. So are you. Apparently, you're providing that I'm service. Servant. You're providing that wow. service. I'm not paid by taxpayers. You're providing that service to somebody, aren't you? I'm, I'm a private entity. You are a public. You're a public servant. You work well, for I will tell you this. My name is Kelsey Fortner. I'm the oh. Community Development Manager over Code Enforcement, Zoning, and the Building Department. And I think what you're doing is very disrespectful, and you're making everybody, including the citizens, did, did, can I ask you a question? Did hurt uncomfortable. Did that hurt your feelings? You hurt my feelings. Did that hurt your feelings? <laughs> Ma'am. I'm my, asking you, did I? Did I am, legitimate question? I think I'm a lot tougher than you uh -oh. are. <laughs> oh, that was good. Keep calm, Frater. You just got punked. Oh, she said she's a lot tougher than you are, Frater. Now, what do you think about those apples? So you just so, so you just admitted that it was because I had this camera. You're so silly. Y'all have a great day though. Okay? What, you just, what you just said. I don't like God bless. Thank you though. That's offensive to me. Guess what? God bless you. God bless you, ma'am. Yep. Because that's part of the first amendment too. This is cool. I like this. Union yeah, citizen. Right. Y'all hear that? Y'all heard it right from the Monroe County, uh, what was she, the, the uh, water Supervisor something? of community something. I didn't forgot her name. So, I'm bad right. with names. But uh, yeah, well, she literally said, I said, what if I came in here without a camera? So there you have it. I'm trying to figure out what was the purpose of this video. Oh, to prove that you can exercise your First Amendment rights to film and to make a few dollars on YouTube. I have it now because it didn't prove anything other than that. Uh, if you enjoy watching idiots, imbeciles, and morons like these two idiots, please subscribe to my channel. <laughs> As always, thanks so much for stopping by. Cheers to that.